Right, morning guys. We are here again for another session. So today we are squatting big, massive squats. That's one of the improvements that I have to make, taking away stuff from the shock. Classic deadlift and squats are two things that I really need to get up. So we're gonna be hitting squats hard. So squats today are gonna be just sleeves. I'm gonna be doing, I think it's free freeze between 220, 240. Again, okay, this is my first week back. And also I'm gonna try flatter shoes again. I used to squat in flat shoes and I used to feel much more comfortable. I don't know why I changed to powerlifting shoes, but we're gonna start again with uh, flat shoes and see if uh, that makes any improvements or not as well. And just get nice and tight and just take my time warming up and just enjoy squatting, you know? Enjoy it. Don't say I hate them, enjoy. Squattings are so enjoyable. So yeah, there's gonna be a big leg stretch in squats, reverse lunges, stiff legs, split leg squats, big leg press, all this kind of stuff. So there's gonna be eight or nine exercises. So come here for the ride. Warm ups, 60 kilograms, 8 to 10 reps. Right, guys, so we're back in the gym again. Me and the Gigantor, Big Tommy. So today I'm doing deadlifts. You can see I've got the suit back on, back in the deadlift bar. So the plan is to go up around 360, see how that feels today. So. That's the heaviest deadlift I've done since, obviously, before this bicep, so we'll just see how it goes. But that's the plan. The brother's back in action again, so hopefully you enjoy it. Well, next set is 180, then probably 220 maybe, and then hopefully working set, so, yeah. We're gonna go 240 for working sets. Very aggressive. I like it. This will be my last kind of warm up. This was heavy warm up. Yeah, 340. Go on to oh, 360. That's a, that's a plan. See how that feels. Sweating like a mother. <laughs> Two forty wasn't the prettiest, but I fell. Nice and no bell. Yeah, and I still have decent energy, which is good, so. A good start to the block. And then uh, getting used to flat shoes again. But yeah, I'll get there. Yeah. I have to tidy them up. Oh. Mm. 
We're doing box jumps, well, bench jumps. I'm done already. We want two stiff leg deadlifts. Three sets of five. So that was the deadlift session, or deadlift exercise done, so worked up to 360 for a double. So now I'm gonna do some suitcase deadlifts, or some single arm farmer's walk pickups, basically. So I did five, five sets on the left, five on the right for three sets, and just a little pause at the top. Just we've got some farmers coming up as well, and it, I think it helps uh, create that stability as well. So get these done, and then, Afterwards, doing some stuff with the sandbag, so uh, sandbag rows and sandbag Claiborne squats as well. So something a little bit different, but again, it's all, all about kind of trying to load up that bicep and see how it reacts and responds. So it's still a little niggly, but it's still hanging in. So that's all we can do. So yeah, we'll get this done. I've got exercises I've not done in ages. Reverse lunges. <laughs> Holy shanners, boys. Sorry enough to go in front lunges. Where am I in reverse? Never done these before, but I think they'll benefit me and hammies and stuff. So, yeah, I'll keep going with them. So hard. Good for coordination as well, isn't it? Last set in this. So that was the lunges, my arse is hurting. Now we're doing isometric um, holds. We're gonna be hellish, 30 second holds. Darn it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Primal strength, they've set this up at sandbag, so fill this up to 100 kilos and I do some pen in the rolls. It's just basically rolls with a sandbag. Again, it gets that bicep working again. So did it last week, but it felt really nice. So hopefully it'll be the same again. Again, it's not huge weights, but just something just to get the blood kind of pumping through that tendon, hopefully. So I've got three sets of tens. So it's not the first set now. Does that look all right, though? Yeah. You dick. This is a try. Try like put your back more vertical, put your hips forward. That feel any bit? Yeah, same. One more in this and then one more little movement with the sandbag. I wake up in the morning and everything's just sore. It's just nice. Like in a good way, just kind of dummy and painful and um, oh, geez, oh, you come away from the gym just feeling like holy, that was bad. It was like two hours or whatever, but just pure madness, <sighs> which is good. Feel something in you burn. It's nice. That's what it's all about, isn't it? That's where we that's where we train. Train to feel the pain. No more. No more feeling numb.
It's only three to so five in this because I'm just going to build up every week, especially after doing all those exercises. So this is like uh, 200, 200. This is like 300 ish. So each week we'll keep going up and up and up with it. Sandbag, Claiborne, squats. So yeah, 100 kilo sandbag. Hold this sandbag into my legs. Sit down on the bench, pull it into my belly. Trap my lats and squeeze it in. And all I'm doing is standing up to the squat movement. work for bicep again. We're starting with incline bicep curls. Reverse curls next, just to finish up. Rest stuff to do. Right guys, another good session for myself and Luke. We're dripping. The sun is at the Caribbean in here, but yeah, I had a really good squat session. Nice to get the head back in and get a sweat on and uh, really push myself a bit. Luke's 360 doubles were uh, spicy, so hard work done. Here, let's go eat, recover, and we're going to do it all again tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Stay, stay smiling, stay spicy. And please don't ever stop ringing that little bell. Ta-da!